Hands for all the marbles, and it's coming up next. We have a real fan favorite versus a formidable opponent. A championship match, what we've all been waiting for. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Universal Championship. It's one of the hottest superstars in WWE, Buzz. Is it me, or is this guy's 15 minutes of fame expired? I think it's just you, because just like a good mattress, Buzz's success seemingly has no expiration date. Is that why our chairs have bed bugs, Saxton? This man is a real force, Drew McIntyre. A revamped attitude, a revamped appearance. McIntyre's made it his mission to eliminate all the complacency in WWE. You know, Drew McIntyre arrived and he was the chosen one. Handpicked by WWE Chairman Mr. McMahon. And Drew will admit that he became complacent. Felt like he didn't have to work hard to get to the top. When he got fired, he went away. He got a new attitude. And now he's back bigger and badder than ever. With a vengeance. Yeah, this new attitude from Drew McIntyre dictates he will take whatever he wants. McIntyre laser focused. Introducing the challenger from Air Scotland, weighing in at 254 pounds, Drew McIntyre. Introducing the champion from Stillwater, weighing in at 280 pounds, he is the WWE Universal Champion, the Terror. Ah, oh, yeah, it's go time. You can feel the electricity running through this arena. Oh, man. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Oh. Close line. Good so, lord. So effective.
Believe it or not, fellas, some people are speculating whether the champ should have to defend the gold against what some are calling inferior competition here tonight. sending a message what power what a slam what damage for i think you're just trying to drum up controversy i haven't heard any whispers about the champion having to defend against inferior competition yeah inferior competition that's nuts i'm willing to bet the champ started that rumor in an attempt to get into his opposition's head either that or corey's just making stuff up as you alluded to michael his feet here and it's moves like that that make him so dangerous look at him he's he's got him covered digging deep for a kick out drew mcintyre has chosen to kick out here see what i did a lot of people are saying the champion has never looked better but that doesn't mean we can't see an upset here tonight He just slammed him with ease. Oh boy, he is rolling. And there's the reversal from Drew McIntyre. As Byron was talking earlier about the champ being a heavy favor here tonight, I couldn't help but think back to the night Santino Morella defeated Umaga for the Intercontinental Championship in 2007. I don't think there was a person alive who thought Santino had even a sliver of hope. They include... What does Buzz have in store? He hits it. Buzz brings everyone to their feet. Incredible. He's lining him up. He'd be... He hits it. Buzz brings everyone to their feet. This one's... He's going for the pin. Just go for the finisher already. I don't understand that the history books will have to wait another day. And here's another peek at some of the more memorable parts of the match. I can watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. Well, that one was over before it even started. I could watch them go at it each and every week. What a match.